Hi, Anna. How you doing? Okay, so I just want to talk about your your work real quick, but let me see here. Where, where are we? Okay, um, this is your um, the back. Now you did get rid of that um, that diagonal. I think that's a definite improvement. Um, so the only other thing I want you to think about before going into um, the final is is this is is um, like, look at your typography. Now keep in mind this is Command R this real quick so we can see that this is um, is that the correct dimensions uh, seventeen. This is seventeen inches wide. So when you print this out, this text right here is going to be just enormous, and I don't think you want that. It's going to look really cumbersome when you see. Um, when you see it in print. So I, I really want you to do that. A couple other things. I think you're just kind of not paying a whole lot of attention to typography in the ter in terms of what we've learned is, is in basic rules. For example, here's an orphan right here, and here's another one right here. Um, technically, that is two, but not really. But, you know, I'm talking about one or two words at the end of a paragraph. Um, and then you have this, uh, this, what is this, 20, 30, 40 year... 30 year uh, gap and you just don't have any typography here there's not enough typography to make it an interesting composition you, 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 if you take the, the image away and everything else and you just look at the typography um, you you know you have some nice alignment but it's that's about really I mean I really want you to experiment here I just again I'm going to go back to the these things, these examples, and take a look at the amount of text we have here. And you really, I mean, you have a timeline, but you have a lot of text. I mean, you can really talk about your um, individual um, laureate as, as much as you want. I mean, this is typography. I've got to see a lot of type, you know what I'm saying? Look at all this type here. Okay, so let's take that into the final, and uh, don't forget about your front cover. I was mentioning maybe thinking about um, working with scale and some other things other than that image of crystals in the background. And then, of course, working, of course, um, with the grid and the uh, structure there. Okay, thanks very much, Anna.